So yes, you can use Shopify for digital products. And in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to quickly sell digital products with Shopify. If you'd like to follow along, I will leave my link in the description. And if you click that, you can get a free trial for Shopify so you can actually follow along with me. I just got a brand new one on a new account just so you can follow along with me in case you are starting from scratch. Let's begin. So the first thing what you wanna do here is create a product very quickly. So we have products on the left and what we're gonna do is click on add product right here. So I'm just gonna put in like the bare bones basics here. This is gonna be the title of your ebook, whatever that's going to be. You know, you'd wanna put that in there. We have a description to make it enticing as well. Make sure obviously someone reads that and they're like, yeah, this is definitely for me, a lot of great benefits and so on and so forth. Media is simply gonna be like the ebook cover if you have one. Give me one moment, I'm gonna upload mine. Alrighty, and look how beautiful. I used AI for that, so there's like some typos there, but not a big deal, okay? Price, let's just say it's gonna be $17. Charge tax on this product. I'm not a CPA, I'm not a lawyer, so it really depends on where you are and who you're selling to, so I'm just gonna leave that as it is. Probably don't have to track inventory, excuse me, quantity on this one, and it's not a physical product, so we can uncheck that. No variance, like we don't have different sizes of ebooks. It's all just gonna be one, right? Genre, target audience, that looks pretty good. And I think we're just gonna stick with that. So let's click on save. All right, great. So now what we wanna do is click on the add apps right here and click on Shopify app store at the bottom. All right, and so what you wanna type in here just to make it easiest is EDP, because we're gonna be getting EDP, which is short for easy digital products. Let's click on that. And here's going to be just kind of like a tutorial of it. So this is what I'm gonna be showing you. Notice how it says in two clicks, and they are pretty much correct. This is probably one of the easiest apps I have found when it comes to selling digital products on Shopify. Nevertheless, I will show you. Let's click on install first right here. You can also do view demo store if you want as well. All right, so it's gonna just say that it needs, needs access to a few things here. If you agree with that, simply click on the install button. All right, and so here we are. There is gonna be a special offer in case you wanna upgrade because their upgraded version gives you a few more perks. And so uh, you can create your first digital product or variant in a few clicks. I'm gonna show you. So let's click right here, create digital product slash variant. Now, remember we gave it a title. In my example, in this tutorial, I just called it ebook. So whatever the title of your digital product is going to be, simply type that in and click on search, and it should show up right there perfectly. We have our ebook here, and simply click on pick product for the one that you created. All right, so here's the easy part. We have all variants, we're definitely keeping it that. Remember we said like there's no different sizes or colors or anything like that because it's not a shirt or pants or anything. So that can stay the same. Now, how to add the file, you can upload it, which is what we're gonna do. This is one of the paid features. So if you wanna add from URL, you can do that. And if no file, this is gonna be good, be good say if you're doing software license keys, which probably not, we're just doing like eBooks, right? So. We have upload here. Let's drag and drop our file or simply click right here so we can upload the file that we have. This is gonna be the ebook file itself, not the cover or anything like that. Okay, so I just did a quick download.pdf, so that's the PDF file. So for license key, we don't have one of those. And this is another one of the paid features. So you can limit downloads per order, which you're probably not going to want to. I mean, they're probably just gonna buy one, right? And then limit downloads in time, probably don't need it for an ebook as well. We also have short description text, which is optional. So it says, write a short text that will appear next to the download button. Now I'm gonna click on see example right here, just so you can see what it looks like. So this is gonna be the test just to kind of showcase it. When someone goes in, they add it to their cart and they purchase it, it's going to show up as like they just spent say $32 here and there's gonna be a download button. This is gonna be the difference here. So you could also say like something in that text, like you know, click the download button to access, get instant access right now. So that's what makes it different in, in terms of using this app. Normally with Shopify, say you're sending out a physical product, but with this, given the fact it's an ebook, they can download it right now, which is gonna be perfect. So that's what it's gonna look like. That's kind of like the demo of it. So let's click okay, just so you know, and do upload and save. Okay, so it's uploading it, almost done. <laughs> it pretty much is done, and there you go. Congrats, your digital product has been created and can now be purchased by your customers. So you saw how it looks like on the end. I'm just gonna show you what it looks like with the little dinky example I created. It's not gonna be anything special, but if you'll notice that when you click on and add it to the checkout, nothing else is gonna be different. Allow me to show you. All right, so there we are. We have our ebook here. I'm just gonna hover over and click on the eyeball right here. Like I said, there's my fantastic ebook cover that I used with um, ChatGPT. So I'm just gonna add to cart for this. 
Then I can do view cart. And like I said, this is gonna be, everything is gonna be identical. You'll notice nothing else is different. It's only on the back end that when they purchase it, they're gonna get that download button. And of course, they can download their digital product immediately, which is exactly what you're looking for. So that should do it. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial when it comes to selling digital products with Shopify. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. And of course, if you haven't gotten to test out Shopify, I will leave my link in the description. And if you click that, you can get a free trial for Shopify to kind of follow along and do this on your own when you're selling your own digital products. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.